Good to go. Okay, losers quarters. We got Adam and Pat rocking with Mario and mid-tier anti-heroes going. Oh my god. Mario and Pat, I think. I'm I'm gonna stop talking about that and I'll commentate now, okay? Anyway, Hollywood is starting to get comboed there. He made it down with the Nair, but now getting advantage on Pat, getting him at the ledge. Yeah, looking at these matchups, I have a feeling that a Vayner might be out comboed by Mario, just with those very consistent plays in and out. Mm -hmm. It's a lot easier to get a grab with Mario than fishing for a side view of Bayo. Right. You have to work a little harder. Mm -hmm. But uh, Juan has Happy on the ledge. Luckily, Sean's coming in to help out his buddy. <laughs> and nice up kill from him, getting Pat off the ledge. Mm. <laughs> as, as he runs into a Mario F smash. The famous Mario. The Shaw classic. Yes. The Mario F smash. And there you go again. Another F smash taking Bayo's first stock. Mm -hmm. Hoping to follow suit with uh, Palutena here. A dunk will do it. The Very nice. Aerial. Getting dunked up to the sky. Um, seems to be just standing still with a smash attack, waiting for someone to come in. Yeah. Seems to be the option. Wolf in danger of being gimped here, but it turns out Palutena unable to connect to the ledge and uh, loses another stock. Right Unfortunate. Off the bat. Mario starting to get a combo going, but that within turning it into Bayonetta's combo. Is that what that's called? Yeah. What is that? Is that just an air dash? So basically, it's the air dodge, but on the last frame of it, and you take half damage, and it's like you actually air dodge down yeah. it. Interesting. Or at least that's what it was in Smash 4, and I'm pretty sure it's the same. Yeah, I just never bothered to learn anything like that. And that's on me. <laughs> anyway, back to the match. Holly Tan has been boxing Mario out until he got that grab. And Bayonetta almost... Uh took Wolf out too, but uh, he's able to make it back just in time for a witch time to send him packing. Bayonetta just avoiding all of Mario's attacks right now. Mm -hmm. But yeah, uh, Shaw still being patient avoiding another witch time. Ooh, trying to help his teammate out, but whipping the up beat. Yeah, hopefully it scared him enough to uh, break the chain a little bit. Mm -hmm. his, uh, with Pat and Shaw attempt to return back to middle ground. Shaw getting punished a bit up high, no second jump. And Yuan is not letting Pat hit the ground though. Because as soon as he does, he's going to bust out the up smash and he's going to take another one. And another one. Ooh, knocking Palutena straight out. He's sitting pretty with three stocks on their team. They're coming in to the rescue. Two against one, I don't see a uh, fan out of it. Nah, like, sure she has a rough D to get people off of her, but what else? Mm -hmm. uh, she could be able to get Wolf, possibly. Yeah, because I know that up is kind of nasty at that. Questionable punish on the witch time. Yeah, I think for some sort of jab combo. That's a cult. Is that? Yeah. You're my eyes and ears for Bayonetta. I, I played her a little bit in Smash 4 just to joke around on her. Oh, nothing coming whiffs out of Whiffs on whiffs. No team I able to capitalize on that. But uh, with solid stage control, I don't see Bayonetta coming back too strongly. Mm -hmm. I think she's back on stage and has center ground, but that doesn't mean much in the 2v1. Yeah. As soon as you deal with one, there's another. And and it, there was an attempt to edge guard Wolf, but not coming out. Excellent roll away from the down smash. And trading with Wolf. And we'll get a stock off. Uh, and we do see the, uh, the stock trade. Just in time to run down and down smash. I think they had their end game in mind. Because that Wolf down smash, that's nasty at the ledge. Aw, oh, thanks, Devin. Really appreciate it. <laughs> That's one for Little Rascals. Yes.
we gonna see a character switch? Yeah, going to the Zero Suit Samus, we saw saw that move a little bit earlier in one of our other matches. I think it worked out pretty well. <laughs> now taking them to PS2. P-Chase is right. Tomoka does have such a way with words. That's my name, all right. Shout out to our boys in chat. So we're heading into game two here. Mario's just going for those early percent combos, hoping the racks turn up. Yeah, both of Red Team already passed 40% with these early combos from both Mario and Wolf. Yeah, I feel like, especially in doubles, Pat just has so many opportunities to just weave his way in and get, you know, 13% off the sort of fair. Mm -hmm. Just, even if Mario hits him up in the air of nowhere, he can sneak in there with a forward air, up air, or whatever, mm -hmm. and just keep that damage piling up. Even when they grab each other, that's just, that's just bros hugging, you know? They're giving each other energy, they man. And they, then they finish, like, just in the middle of the sentence, they finish off socks on both sides. I think I saw the Zero Suit down B into something, maybe a Wolf Up Smash, not 100% sure, but anyways. I'm getting close, but not able to uh, box out Sean on the side there. Um, and Pat's still sitting pretty in the middle. He's got nowhere else he wants to be. Mm -hmm. Like his goal right now is just to throw out forward airs and hope that it wins. Yeah. But now, Pat getting off the ledge. Just racking up more and more percent. Uh, finally getting witch time on Sean. Taking out the stock. But, uh, at the cost of wand stock as well. I'm not getting hit by that F smash right there. Allowing Pat to go in for the punish. Yeah, he's looking like a dominant game too. Mm -hmm. They're still sitting at five stocks, and that's sitting pretty in And it seems like even though Pat keeps getting hit by these ledge options, he seems mostly in phase until Wan rushes in with a side B to finish it off and let Juan or uh, Vincha get back online. But the wolf dash attack is taking Theo's last or second stop. Juan at 69 percent what will he do? You tell me I don't know what he's gonna <laughs> do. Seems like he got get hit, hit right into that yeah. F smash. Ooh, trying to trap Mario at ledge but a little risky eating getting a little an up paper. smash. Now this is tournament stock for the mid-tier heroes, or mid-tier anti-heroes, my bad. That's right. And uh, this is almost exactly what we saw last game, but with a few more stocks in Blue Team's name. Mm -hmm. It's, uh... I think they're going to go for something funny. I'm sure they will. It's uh, just a matter of time. Mm -hmm. They'll play out. Because they definitely have the resources. Bayonetta somehow safely getting off ledge with the coverage there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these rolls have been on. Oh point. my god! <laughs> and the double up smash. Alright, even if they don't win, uh, mid tier anti heroes are making a statement right now. Yeah. Saying that they're, they're playing not one to be right finagled with. Interesting trade will take game two. Going with little, little rascals. They head in the losers' semis. Good job, the little rascals.